Welcome back, family. This is your boy, E.D. For all you smart and intelligent folks out there, listen, that just simply means, Ed, here we go. I, You know what? I knew you were asking this question and you wanted me to unpack this in a way that it made sense, that it, that we got right to it and I, I got you. So the question of the day is, how much does it cost to take the CAPM exam? Again, how much does it cost to take the CAPA exam? CAPM exam. Now, you know that I just couldn't break it down regularly or averagely, you know, what average people would do because this is an exceptional channel. And because we're exceptional, we're going to break it down in an exceptional format. So I'm going to give you my foundational principle and I mean, excuse me, my foundation and I'm going to give you my three principles. Foundation. So if you haven't learned by now, certify, uh, excuse me, CAPM stands for Certified Associate in Project Management or Certified Associate Project Manager. That is our foundation. I have other videos that go more in depth about what this is and what it, what, what it requires. But you want to know how much this thing costs. As of April 2023, so, so as far as April 2023, the year that is, if you are a member to take the test, to pay the admission cost to take the test will be $225. If you are not a member, it will cost you $300. Now, I broke this down of my points into three factors. Factor one, the financial fee. Factor two, the time fee. And factor three or point three, same thing, is the commitment fee. So we just went over the financial fee, which as I'm talking through this and I'm thinking, I didn't even add in the cost it was required in order to get your contact hours. Because you're required to have contact hours, which is, a, I think it's 20, no, I don't think I know. I'm just messing with you. There's 23 contact hours that are required, educated hours in order for you to be able to sit and take the test. So it depends on where you get your uh, training from. If you got it from, who knows? I don't know what, what that cost is. So I couldn't, I couldn't put that variable in there, but it is a cost and it can cost anywhere from, I've seen CAPM courses as cheap as probably about 20 bucks all the way up to about $2,000, $3,000 for a CAPM course. So Again, it varies, but for the exam itself is going to cost you as a member $225 and as a non-member $300. Plus, now keep this in mind too, we didn't keep about this cost, the cost for the actual membership to actually have a PMI membership. So again, that, that number may vary year over year. Um, and again, this is as April 2023. So the time fee, yeah, there's a fee for your time, meaning... How long is this going to take you? I covered this in a previous video. I said the, it would roughly take around about, um, and this, and again, this is subjective because it depends on your commitment. What are you willing to commit to? But for the CAPM, and I'm only speaking for the CAPM, I think you can get the CAPM knocked out um, depending on your study habits, depending on your work schedule, depending on your life schedule. Um, it could be 90 days. Typically, I think if I, I on the on the uh, other video when I talked about the cap M in more depth, I said six. I said uh, ninety to about six months. More on the six months <laughs> standpoint uh, than the early ninety days. But again, it depends on what your situation. If if you if you're not working and you have all the time to, to focus on the cap M, then yeah, you probably will. Matter of fact, I know you would get it knocked out in ninety days or less. But typically it's about 90 days to six months. And again, it depends on the program that you're in. It depends on, there's too, there's so many depending factors that that was hard to list. But however, there's a third piece here, your commitment fee. So we talked about the financial fee. We talked about your, your time fee. Now the commitment fee. Are you going to get started and stop? Are you going to have the ability to finish what you said that you wanted? A lot of people say they want the CAPM. A lot of people say they want the PMP. 
but they're unwilling to invest the commitment that is required in order to sit down and go through the boring, tedious of remembering facts, remembering data, then taking their own experience in it and combining it all together. Because when you look at that commitment fee, there's a commitment that's going to be required to be to spend time away from friends, to spend time away from family. You know, those special events that may come up that you may want to go see or movies or entertainment that you may want to do. And again, it depending on what your schedule is and how you set this up. If you set up an aggressive, hey, I want to get this knocked down in 60 to 90 days, you definitely gonna have to give up those things until, because you're gonna be spending the majority of your time studying. The majority of your time, excuse me, I shouldn't say studying, mastering and honing your craft. So if you're willing to in, invest in that commitment fee and the commitment fee, again, is you, you stepping up and doing what you're supposed to do, you making sure that everything is going the way that it's supposed to, this would be a no-brainer. And I, again, family, I want to expound on something. Again, like I said, the financial fee, to me, is definitely more than what I talked about here. Because, again, just to rehash that, there is the the fee that you have to pay for the actual course. So again, and that I told you, I, I've seen them as cheap as 20 all the way up to two, 3,000. Then it's the fee for the actual member. If you decide to be a member, you're gonna have to pay PMI to be a member, which I'm a member of PMI. And, and that's why if you see, if you're, if you're a non-member, you save $75. So it kind of just pays for itself, the membership does. And I forgot the, how much the membership is at this point as of April 2023. Um, but of course, I know you can Google that and figure that out. Um, so family, I'll say all that to say that just don't look at the financial cost of what it costs to take this exam, the CAPM, and look at the overall commitment, look at the overall time, and look at the overall financial fee. This is your boy ED. For all you smart and intelligent folks, hey, they just simply means it. And this is the video that I hope encourages encourages more people to go after the uh, the cap m certification encourages more uh future or existing pms to really invest in themselves until next time i'm out